Russian fishermen were out in a boat on the Pacific when they hauled in this one-ton monster. It's not unknown for strange things to be dredged up from the ocean, but this one was incredible. The fishermen hadn't been expecting something of this size. Surely it was a record. The ocean is full of unusual fish and the surprises it hides just keep on coming. From abyssal creatures that look like horror movie monsters to gargantuan squid and who knows what else is down there. The creature in question was caught by a group of Russian fishermen. Now although the sailors haven't been named, they come from Interrup on one of the Kuril Islands. On September 9, 2017, the men's trawler was fishing the waters off the southern Kuril Islands, but when the sailors reviewed their haul, they were stunned. Not only was the fish that the men had captured a rare one, but it was also an incredible size. More specifically, their nets had ensnared a colossal ocean sunfish. Rather confusingly, the species is also known as a moonfish in Russia. And the mammoth monster weighed an astonishing 2,424 pounds, a size locals claim is unheard of in those waters. Indeed, Russian news channel RT confirmed this fact on September 14, 2017. There has been no such specimen that I can remember, Balkarov said. There is the dolphin fish, also known for its size, but I've never seen a sunfish weighing more than a ton here before, he concluded. And it wasn't just the monster's size that had the online community locked in debate. They were also divided over its identity. Some claimed the fish was indeed an ocean sunfish, also called a mola mola but others recognized it simply as a sunfish or opa. As it transpired though, the creature was indeed an ocean sunfish. The key to its identity is the tail, or lack thereof. You see, whereas opa have tails, mola mola don't. And it's this feature that marked the catch as an ocean sunfish. Ocean sunfish get their name from their peculiar tendency to float to the ocean surface to sunbathe. In addition, they belong to the bony fish group, as they have bones instead of cartilage. Usually though, ocean sunfish are docile creatures that show no aggression toward humans. Their diet typically consists of smaller fish, jellyfish, fish larvae, and crustians, and is actually of low nutritional value. Despite its impressive size, however, the sunfish caught by the Russian fishermen isn't the heaviest specimen on record. Indeed, one snared in 1910 off Santa Catalina Island, California, was reckoned to have weighed 3,500 pounds. In fact, it took the men upwards of 24 hours to agree on a course of action. By then, however, time had run out for the ocean sunfish. Used to living in the ocean depths, it had died. As a result, when the sailors arrived back at Interrup, they took the remains of the fish ashore. The behemoth's carcass then remained in the port for another two days, and it was here that it began to decay. Meanwhile, scientists from the Sakala Museum had heard news of the massive catch. Excited by the rare sea creature, the experts wanted to preserve its remains, but its rapid decay put paid to their plans. You see, the fishermen didn't want their catch to go to waste. Consequently, they took the rotting corpse to what the Siberian Times called Fish Safari. This is a place on Kareel where locals leave fish scraps for brown bears. And some people approved of the fact that the ocean sunfish fed a potentially starving animal. On the Siberian Times, one person commented, good idea to feed the bears. Yes, many thought that the fish should never have been left to die in the first place. Another internet commenter said, please, it is necessary to protect fishes, especially rare specimens and deep water sea fish. 
Among their number were the scientists from the Sakhalin Museum who lamented the loss of the ocean sunfish. Missing out on such a unique display specimen must have been a blow to them. As a result, if the fishermen land another significant catch, it will go to the Sakhalin Museum. So as tragic as the loss of such a magnificent deep sea fish is, at least the body didn't go completely to waste.